I actually feel like a bird of prey right now, just sitting up here hunting people. Oh, okay. We see a guy. Let's go in. We're going for him. All the way down. We're going for that kill. He's going to be on the back side of this house. Get ready. There he is. Come on. There we go. Oh my god. That felt brutal. And he had another launch pad. My man. What's going on, guys? And welcome back to the channel. Now, it's only a day until Season 3 of Fortnite begins. And with Season 3 is coming one of the biggest changes the game has seen in a while. The fact that they're going to be removing the double pump from the game, which you can see me using right here. Now, this has been a very, very controversial feature to keep in the game, to say at the very least. Some people love it and some people hate it, with a lot of us kind of floating somewhere in the middle of the two sides. So today, even though I've been avoiding using it for the past couple of months now, I thought we'd come in and give it one final send-off. One last victory royale with a double pump to remind us all why this thing really does need to be removed from the game, in my opinion. Now, before we get in and get this victory royale, I thought I'd also just really quickly mention I've also been uploading videos to my second channel over the past couple of weeks. So up there, you're going to see a lot of different variety games. Me, Bazza, Craig, Jared, and playing Sea of Thieves, being an idiot, playing hand simulator, Jenga, all this really, really dumb stuff. But for those of you who want to see me doing a bit more variety and not just the Overwatch and Fortnite, which you're still going to get on the main channel, that's the place for you. And I thought we'd add in a couple of little kind of dumb bonus goals. So if we get that channel to 100,000 subscribers by the end of the week, I'm going to do a bit of an epic Q&A behind the scenes video. Show you guys where I make the videos and all that kind of stuff, which will be uploaded to the second channel. And if by some miracle it gets to 500,000, and we are gonna eat a really really hot chili why why you ask well because I hate spice and it's it's really gonna suck to make that that's why the objective for that one is set so freaking high but I believe we can do it so I'm gonna leave a link to that channel in the description but without further ado guys let's get into the video all right guys here we go the final days of the double pump shotgun in Fortnite Battle Royale it's been an interesting few months with this as I mean most people either they love it to death because it carries them to victories or they hate it because it ends any chance they ever had of getting a victory royale. I kind of always sat in the middle. You guys know that when it first got added to the game I was the kind of person who used the double pump. I thought it was kind of like a cool little unique thing that you could use to just kind of get a little bit of extra damage but at the cost of it taking up two inventory slots and taking a little bit of skill. Obviously as you guys know over the past few weeks I have severely changed my tone. I've stopped using it entirely, not because it's not good, but because, well, it's too good. It was way too powerful, and honestly, I felt really, really cheap winning games with it. So I decided to try and be a better person, set a better example, and stopped using it entirely. But now, considering this is going to be the final day that the double pump is in the game, we're making an exception, and we are bringing it back for a one-time only special appearance on this channel. And, well, I mean, one of the last times you were ever going to see the double pump in Fortnite Battle Royale. I mean, it's still going to exist in a form, but essentially you won't be able to get off more than two shots with it in the future before you have to actually repump and reload. Looks like we're getting some interesting guns to start things off with. We got one pump action, but I want two. I need two. And if we're going to be using the double pump, we need to be going for a seriously, seriously high kill count. You can't abuse broken weapons and not go way, way, way above your standard kill quitter. And okay, we've got a guy coming up here who I'm going to absolutely, totally bungle a shot on. No, 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 don't kill each other. Don't kill each other. And there we go. All right, my kill. We've got a guy up this hill here, right there. And he's dead. Now, the dude down there had mini shields. We've got to be careful. And okay, here they are. Dance, friends! Or not? No, that was my kill, you bastard! You're ruining my high kill count! Okay, you know what? Screw it. It's fine. I'm gonna go down here. I'm gonna drink this mini shield up. That was only one kill we missed out on. I'm not too angry. I'm just a little bit angry. And then, okay, we're gonna grab that second pump action. And we are looking good for the double pump action. Okay, let's go over here. There's another little mini shield on the ground, which I would gladly take, and a med kit. All of which I'm really going to need, because right now we are not looking good as far as health goes. 
Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. And I still can't see an assault rifle. I'm not blind. I'm just pretty sure there are no assault rifles in this game at the moment. Which is very, very strange. Let's uh, let's get those shotgun shells out there, though. And then we're going to keep on moving. Shotgun shell number one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you know what? We'll grab that just because it's some kind of... Oh, God. Here we go. Oh, my. What the hell? That guy was just... He was wandering around totally clueless. I feel guilty. We're going to go clean up whoever is left alive up there. And then we're going to leave this town and keep on going. Like I said, if we're doing the double pump, you best believe... We're going for some high kill count games. Otherwise, I mean, really, it's kind of embarrassing. All right, no one over there. No one's left yet. Where are the enemies? There's got to be someone over here. There's got to be someone left. Unless maybe they've already gone? No, surely they wouldn't have left yet. There are more kills to be had. No, okay, apparently they might have gone. Yep, no, I'm pretty sure they've gone. God damn it. All right, we're leaving. We don't even have an assault rifle. We've cleared the entirety of Retail Row, and there's nothing but an SMG. I'm, I mean, I'm sure the comment section is going to tell me in a couple of, you know, minutes, like, uh, at, at two minutes, 42 seconds, you you left a, a gun on the ground. But you know what? Screw you guys, okay? It's an intense battle. I can't see every single thing. Sometimes you just, you forget stuff that gets left behind, and you look a little bit stupid. Okay, though, we're going to go this way. Down into the Salty Springs, straight past Factory, out to the field, and hopefully out towards a whole lot more bad guys. I reckon then we're going to go towards Tomato Town. Because when this zone moves in, there are going to be a whole lot of people fighting in that direction. Okay, and oh, purple tack shotgun in there. But that's not what I'm here for today. Any other day, I'd be very, very happy with that. But not today. Have we got a chest in here? Not even a chest in there. What am I even doing that for? Where are the enemies, man? It's like I said, we need 15 kills at least if we're going to be doing the double pump. You cannot play passive. You need to be running at every single enemy you spot. There is no excuse not to be playing like an absolute suicidal maniac. And right now, I'm trying. I really, really am. Like, I want to fight people more than anything. But other people don't want to fight me. Up here? Anything? On the high ground? No? No one at factory? No one anywhere, apparently. Okay, what if we come over here? There have got to be enemies in the field. There are always enemies out here. I feel like we're a little bit late to the fight, though. You can see all this building. Oh, no, there we go. And stop running. All right, here we go. He's building up. We're going to keep going forward. And we are eventually going to kill this guy. Just had to shoot that out so he couldn't actually shoot back at me. All right, here we go. We're closing the distance. Getting within that double pump range. And now it's time to go right over the top. And adios! Oh, not yet. Where are you? Where's he gone? Oh, he's right here. Come on. And there we go. All right. He had a launch pad, though. Oh, things are about to get a very, very interesting, guys. You know what we're going to do? We're going to go all the way up here, all the way to the top of the hill. And we're going to do that launch pad because it is probably one of my favorite things to do in the game. Especially when actually right now we're pretty close to the middle of the zone. We can just set up up here and then we can hunt people. Literally non-stop. We're just going to sit at the top of this mountain, watch for people, and then launch pad right into their faces with the double pump. It's going to be pretty brutal. But you know what? We already sold our soul to get the victory royale. So really, I mean, nothing's changed. All right. Oh my god, there's a chest up here. Someone left a perfectly good chest that contained absolutely nothing in it. Okay, there's an SMG right there. We got to keep going, though. We need to build all the way up as quickly as we can. Okay, please no one shoot this out. We're almost at the top. And here we go. Okay. Now, all I need to do is quickly come out here. Build that. Put this around me. And then we can look out for enemies. Let's uh, probably also put this on the ground. I feel like that would be a that would be a that would be a pretty good move. Where are the bad guys at? I got a launch pad and I'm not afraid to use it. Come on, there have got to be people coming in from all these directions. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No one in the field. A little bit confusing. No one out there. No one in Salty Springs. Come on, people. No one even on that mountain. Take a sniper shot at me. Do something. I refuse to believe that there's no one around here. This is like right in the middle of the next zone as well. We are going to be a double pump demon. Jumping at any moving thing I see out in this field. I see something move. 
We're going to kill it. That's how this is going to go. And... Oh, okay. I see a guy down there. Here we go, guys. Get ready. You guys see him? Where is he? Where did he go? Oh, he's under me. And there we go. He's dead. You know what? He was double pumping too, so we don't even have to feel that guilty about what just happened. What we do need to do though is get right back up the top of our hill. Because I need 15 kills. Like I said, guys, that's our quota. If we don't hit that, I'm going to be mightily disappointed in me. You know? And I'm sure you guys will be disappointed in me as well. Because everyone wants an action-packed game. All the way up. All the way up. All the way up. All the way up. Here we go. And right back to our good old base. Any enemies yet? No? Okay. Still can't see anyone. And I really want to be playing as aggressively as we possibly can. That's always the goal in every single game of Fortnite we have on this channel. You guys know... Oh, okay. We got another guy who's literally in the exact same spot where we just killed that dude. You know what? I'll do it. Screw it. Man wants to die. Man wants to die. And he's right around here. And it also looks like he might be fighting someone. How peculiar. And... Goodbye, bro. Oh, he wasn't double pumping. Oh, but this guy is. And... Adios, senor. Okay, let's move out of here. What do we got? We got... Oh, we got a sniper. We got a lot of good gear. I think this guy had a legendary rocket launcher as well. Which I'm kind of tempted... You know what? We're going to grab that. That's going to be my giant fuck you weapon. It's always nice to have a big old F you weapon. That you can just literally... If a fight gets too nerve-wracking... If it gets too intense, you literally shoot your big FU weapon and then everyone dies. Okay, let's go back to our mountain though. All the way back to the top. I really hope this stays inside for one more zone. I just want to be I just want to be using this like non-stop for the rest of the game. That's like my dream. Just non-stop jumping at people, shooting them in the face, and getting that sweet, sweet victory royale. Let's go, 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 go. Can't see any enemies over there. But if we can spot our next target before we even get to the top, that'd be pretty ideal. Okay, no one over there to the side. No one behind. I'm assuming those two are going to be the ones from Tilted Towers. So I'm expecting to see some people in that Salty Springs direction. The only reason there wouldn't be is because there is a bit more space between where they need to be in the zone and where these people need to go to be in the zone. Okay, all the way back at the top though. I'm half expecting there to just be a guy who's like secretly taken over my base while I've been away. And like we just walk in on him about to use the launch pad. Oh, where have they gone? Come on, enemies. Oh, okay. I see a guy down there. We're going for it. We're just outside the next zone. We're going to need to find a new launch pad. And okay. Here's this guy. Oh, he's using the raptor skin as well. Brother, what is happening? Oh my lord. Dude just got one shot in the head. Zero notice, zero warning. Just immediate, unscheduled death. Okay, now I'm going to assume that there might be another enemy in the factory. And look, just look at the building up there, man. That looks really, really terrible. Like, it's pretty obvious that there's going to be someone up there. But no one's taken a shot at me yet. Do you know what? I really appreciate that. Okay, let's grab the green shotgun and let's move out. Can't see anyone at the factory. And right now, I'm kind of hoping that we can find a better rifle soon. We should be able to find a scar. That's going to be pretty crucial when it comes to the way that we win this game. We need to keep staying on the front foot though. 11 enemies left alive. We've got nine kills. I want at least half of these people left to die to me. That's the only thing that's going to make me happy right now. I'm very, very hard to please. Now, where would I be if I were an enemy? I'm assuming that pretty much everyone else who's left alive is going to be over at Fatal Fields. But I'm kind of hoping if I can maybe just start shooting, someone's going to shoot at me as well. Okay, can I make this jump? Oh, oh there we go. Pure skill. Pure ability. Pure class. Where are the bad guys at? Come at me, bro. Oh, no one over there. No one down there. No one in the Salty Springs. Come on, we've got to be able to spot someone. We've got to be able to spot an enemy. Oh, and there we go. Okay, I've got a guy. We're going. Let's move. He's a little bit far off. I don't know if we're going to be able to catch him. Oh, but there he is. You guys can see him. I think he's about to go just inside this hut. Hello! It's me, your cousin! Is he gonna look up? Oh, 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 oh. And... 
Adios! Oh my god, that was way too close. Let's go. Okay. Let's build up some cover here. Let's get shielded back to the max. I'm gonna drink that shield potion as well. And then we are good to go. Oh, that was actually a lot more intense than I would have liked. I probably shouldn't have landed right on top of him. That was a bit of a BM move. When you're playing like an idiot, you gotta really commit to playing like an idiot. Okay, now I reckon our next port of call should be to go up on that hill. I might quickly just use this med kit right here. Just because I feel like it could be a good idea to get all the way back to the maximum amount of health. You don't always need it, but the number of times I've won a fight on 19 health or less is not to be underestimated. Okay, and then we're going to keep the tempo up. We're literally just going to keep on running non-stop for the rest of this game. Did I see a guy over there? I'm not 100% sure. I think I might have been hallucinating the edge of the zone. Yep, no, I was. Okay, that's fine. But we need to keep on going. 10 people left alive. That's actually a pretty surprising number. I literally want to get shot at right now. That would make me really happy. Please, people. Let's go. Let's fight. Let's do this. Anyone over there? Nope. No one over there. Anyone out in the field? Can't see anyone. If I spot a base, we can literally go right for it. I'm also kind of wondering if there's going to be anyone down at Salty. There's always those people who are really, really good at hiding and you don't really spot them until it's too late. There's got to be someone on the edge of the zone here, though. Although, oh, you know what? Maybe our best bet... Oh, yeah, I can see a guy all the way at the top of that tower. We're just going to start shooting, you know? Screw it. Start shooting rockets. Start blowing up towers. Start getting those kills. And hopefully, this guy is going to die. Although, maybe he's just going to build himself all the way down. Let's, uh, let's run around the edge of the zone on this side. Because at the very least, we can kill that guy when he exits his tower. I feel like a good move for us... It's just going to be to keep moving towards that dude. Oh, you can see we've got an enemy right here. And, oh, hello, sir. Sorry, bro. This will be the end for you, I'm afraid. And, adios. There we go. Not even a single point of damage taken. Oh, boy. We are going to hell. That's one thing I know for sure. How many minis did he have? He had 10. We're going to grab all of those. And then we're going to go hunt this guy down. Can't see anyone on the low ground here. That's fine, though. We've got 11 kills and there are still 8 people alive. Now, where was the dude in this tower? He's going to have to move out. And, oh my god, you can see they're fighting, but no! Oh, one of them died every single time I see someone die in the kill feed. It makes me a sad, sad man. Because it's just going to make hitting this kill quota a little bit harder. I reckon we're actually... We're going to lead with the rocket launcher this time. Screw it. No, no, no. My kill. My kill. My kill. My kill! Stay away! All right, where are you, bro? Oh, there you are. And... Oh, no, 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 no. No, you don't. Okay. Give me that trap. Did this guy have a launch pad? I need something fancy. I need a fancy gun. You know, something that a fancy person would use. Oh, my God. We can actually reach our kill quota here, guys. We need to keep playing so, so kill hungry. But we can do this. We can actually do this. Is anyone in here? No one's over here. I don't think. Let's reload our gun and keep on moving in. There could be a guy in the roof there. We only need two more kills and we're set. Come on. Where are the enemies, man? I've literally run... Oh, okay. Yep, there was definitely one in here. Let's shoot that rocket in. And let's just keep on blowing it up. Put holes in all of the bases. Come on. Where is he? Where is he? And see you later, bro. All right. Oh my God. We're actually going to do it against all the odds. We need one more kill. And we've actually reached the number of kills that I wanted to get this game. Assuming we don't get shotgunned in the face. Which, you know what? To be fair, I feel like would be pretty good karma for how we've played so far. It'd be pretty bloody good karma. Okay. Now, we've kind of... It's weird. We've done a full circle around the zone here. I'm just trying to figure out where I would be if I was still alive in this game. Let's uh, maybe shoot, put a rocket in here. You know, you can never you can never blow up too many houses in Fortnite. That's what I always say. And okay, I guarantee you there's a guy in Salty Springs. There's probably also going to be one other guy hiding in a bush. And I mean, they're, they're the last two people alive. So that's pretty much all there is. Now, I'm assuming that I don't have... There's no one up here, right? We go all the way up. Let's go all the way up. Yep, no one up here. Although, oh no. No, that's my kill. Get away from him. No! 
I didn't even get to meme. Oh my god, an accidental victory royale. I <laughs> think. Guys, if this game showed anything, I hope it really nailed home once and for all the fact that the double pump really does need to be removed from the game. It definitely was way, way, way too strong. And I personally am really excited to get back to playing the game the way that it's meant to. Because I kind of miss being able to run in and take close range fights without fearing for the fact that I'm just going to get one shot in the face. But guys, remember to check out the second channel. Link in the description. We got a possible chili video and Q&A video that's going to be posted over there in the next couple of days. But as always, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you legends in the next one. Bye-bye.